Hi, I'm Nancy Brown, CEO of the American Heart Association, here today with Abigail Davis, 18 years old, recently named the American Heart Association's You're the Cure Youth Advocate of the Year. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm excited. We are so impressed with the work that you have done to help fight the tobacco industry, who yet again is trying to take advantage of America's youth through their recent work in promoting vaping. And you've been a huge leader in our Tobacco 21 work. Tell us a little about what you've done. Yeah, I testified actually for Tobacco 21 legislation in Arkansas, and I was able to talk to them about how people in my high school were vaping. And sometimes that started out in eighth grade, and by the years went on, it became more prevalent. And so we needed to make a stop to this. And so I was able to testify for that. And I'm so excited to be here in Washington, D.C. to talk to lawmakers about how we can also take further steps to further that in the future. It's so important that people who have been affected speak up, and especially youth, because this issue with the tobacco industry targeting young people you know people pay attention when people who are affected talk about it tell what do you see with your friends and are they vaping and how do you help get them in to become advocates as well yeah well actually kind of in Arkansas I'm known as that girl that did testify for tobacco 21 it's actually helped me reach out to so many of my friends because they are vaping unfortunately and they do need to know the facts you know people are now getting diagnosed with so many different sicknesses or dying because of this and they don't know why and they need to well, you are an articulate voice for the mission of the American Heart Association. So here you are in Washington, D.C. What will your messages be to those uh, lawmakers you have an opportunity to meet with while you're in town? I think it's important that I'm speaking for my um, the people in my youth group just because I had that personal connection and my personal friends are doing that. Um, and so I think when they hear me as an 18 year old, a freshman in college, that I'm walking around campus and seeing people do it all the way to class, they're not able to stop, they're addicted and this needs to be put to a stop. So that will be your message uh, to your elected officials. Thank you so much for all you do. Congratulations again. And for others who'd like to become involved, please visit the American Heart Association's You're the Cure Network at yourthecure.org. Learn how you can lift your voice for heart health. Visit yourthecure.org.